where did the summer go? So we're going to turn into, turn into fall, the tamaracks are turning, and the leaves are yellow and orange are falling. The summer just flew by. We're on our, uh, we got one more week of the, the fish fences, and then we were uh, up on the, our highest fish fence Monday, and uh, it actually, for our three mile hike in there and out of there, uh, snowed on us. You know, it was just little, little flakes, but man, it snowed on us pretty good for quite some time. It didn't stick or nothing like that, but, and it's got a chill in the air today, but it is just, just amazing up here today. Been doing a little bit of uh, whole grouse hunting. Been doing some of that. Um, definitely, there's a 10-year cycle on grouse, and last year was the the prime. I mean, it was it was unreal last year. Wow. Wow. We're in the middle of nowhere, and just got a phone call. <laughs> That's crazy. I'd trip me out. Yeah, me too. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, anyway, so it's a 10-year cycle on the the grouse. And last year was the 10. I mean, it was amazing. And this year, you know that uh, some old boy was telling me about the 10-year cycle. And it definitely is a sure thing because they're down. I've got uh, this year two, you know, big blue blue grouse, and then I don't know, probably. 12 or 15 forest grouse this year, you know, which is still pretty good, but I've been seeing a lot of, uh, a lot of hunters is what I've been seeing up here. We had the, was it a hundred and the big fire over in Boise County, our old stomping grounds, Boise County, Atlanta, Idaho, and Idaho City area, which the fire is still burning. I think we they calculate what 180 or 190 thousand acres, which has pushed the uh, all the hunters over, you know, on this side yeah, in central Idaho. And man, they're uh, they've been just tearing it up up here, man. The, it's crazy to see, you know, the litter which I'm always griping about. And it's worse up here this year than it than I've ever seen it. And then uh, our fences, man, they've uh, well, we had one that cut the fence. Cows got in where they shouldn't be, and then they actually cut what, seven, seven or eight of our fences this year, and messing with our electric fences. And like I said, there's just hunters everywhere. But I don't know. I just wanted to do a little video. Haven't been on there much. Been doing a lot of building on the homestead as I got time so I'll have to show some of that getting Miss Kitty's cookhouse and a hey. got us got us a uh, propane water heater um, it's a never you know endless on, de on demand on demand hot water heater that as soon as I get the well the cookhouse and then it's going to have a, a shower room off of it so we'll have a year round shower this year so that'll be nice that'll beat we've been using a wash tub and uh heating up hot water for three years now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so that'll definitely be a, a different experience. Maybe it'll be like uptown. Then what else, Miss Kitty's going on? You want me to turn that camera on you? No, I just want to get in the sun where it's a little bit warmer. Right, a little bit warmer. Walk over and actually yeah. check out the backside camera. I don't even really see yeah. it. Up there. Like I said, I don't know what the temperature is. It's chilly. They're talking about being in the you know, like high 70s uh, by Wednesday for a few more days. It's just been going like this here. Just crazy weather. Oh, and hunting season. Uh, so the hunters that we've had that have been causing all the havoc up here, which they're usually pretty good, so the bow hunters uh, are usually pretty, pretty respectable and stuff like that. But uh, and then. Uh, Monday is opening rifle season. That's usually when all heck really breaks loose up here. But we only have, it opens on Monday, and our last day of our fences are on the 15th. 
So, unless they extend it, you know, because they were talking to one of the ranch hands and stuff, and he's, they've been up here every day this week and can't find their dang cows, so if that happens, sometimes we'll end up doing it a few more extra days and stuff. What else is going on around the... Enjoying the grandbabies. Oh, yeah, the man, grandbabies. it's great. Yeah, I have to show a little... Of course, TNT is always amazing, but little Kaylee's just getting... Oh, she's just... <laughs> she's definitely the princess. Yeah. Man, Katie Jo has got what she wanted, but this one's even... She's crazy. She's awesome. She's awesome. And then... I guess that's about the extent of yeah, it. You have to do a video back on the homestead. Yeah, I'll have to do a video on the homestead. I keep saying Show I the projects. Do that, just haven't... Man, they haven't just done any videos. Just haven't been... Just ain't been feeling it, man. <laughs> <laughs> you know, sometimes Nothing wrong you with do that. It and sometimes you don't. You know, and the summer flew by for, you know, we got doing them dang shows and burned ourselves out on that after nine weeks of setting up every week. And, uh, yeah, that's about, about the extent of that. It was our summer, was that. And didn't do too much fishing, getting ready to do some steelhead fishing. Steelhead should be coming on here pretty quick. Steelhead, little hunting. Been putting up wood, man. Been putting up a lot of wood. Built me, uh, Two new, like so have to film the homesteads. Yeah. I got two new uh, woodsheds on the homestead, and I've got them one completely full, and then I like to call them wood cribs. Cause basically they're smaller, you know, not a huge wood shed. I got one holds about a cord, and then the other one's probably two, two and a half cords. I got both of those about full. Probably got another, I'd say another two cords sitting on the homestead, and then we're bringing in a little cord quarter to two a week and we'll do that till the end of uh, end of um, November close of November 30th less snow flies man it could close next week yeah so you all have a, a wonderful day and, and a better tomorrow like old Bob would say and uh, doing it cheap yep doing it cheap check out I haven't even talked to old Bob for a while I need to gotta make him a knife too. that's what I haven't been doing really haven't been making too many Wood carving knives, hoping to make some this weekend and uh, moving the forge again and get ready to build the, my my little dream blacksmith shop here after I get, first I'm getting Miss Kitty's cook shack done uh -huh. for anything. Oh yeah. So, well, dude, I know some people have been asking for some blacksmithing videos and then one of the reasons we're doing these videos longer, just doing this whole thing at one time is... Uh, the data for to download the editor and stuff we actually had to pull our computer off out and take it over to Katie Joe's and just haven't Done. been feeling that either <laughs> so other than that man everything is beautiful everybody's well hope you all are well out there and enjoy your week see you next time